Easter poured into the cranberry sauce. It's time for more Breakout Beast opening. Hello, what's up? I'm the Total Blood Doom here doing another video for you guys, and this time we are opening a Series 6 Breakout Beast. Yes, we've gone all the way to Series 6, and we are going to open one of the eggs. They're all in different colors except for orange. Apparently there's like three different orange ones, so I have no idea what's inside it, but it's on a rubbery cocoon thing that's a different mold than the first four series. So, uh, yeah, hopefully it's not blue slime, because it seems that the blue slime all comes out in liquid for some reason. Let's go ahead and open and see what breakout beast is like! Alright, there's the lid. I know it says, oh, you're supposed to cut like a line, but there's really no point. You can just pretty much peel it off. Hopefully, the tab won't come off, because these are really glued in there. In fact, this one kind of feels like... Oh, there we go. I was able to get it. Felt like it was coming out with the rubber inside. And then it seems that we've got the uh, other layer of that plastic. That, that's an oopsie. I don't think that was supposed to happen, but oh well. We'll just peel that off and we've got some crimson slime for this one. <laughs> Let's see, it seems like the instructions are getting in the way of pulling this out. There we go, there's all the pieces and ooh, I think I know exactly which one this is. I don't know if you could see inside, but it seems like all the slime was just put to the side. I mean, it's still mixed in with the pieces, but there's the slime, there's the parts. Doesn't really seem like it's gonna be that difficult to take it out, so I'm gonna do that off camera, but there's the slime. Lovely crimson, marbly slime. Yes! Yes! Alright, well, now that my hands feel disgusting, here's the pile of parts and here's the instructions. Let's go ahead and take a look at what beast is inside. Series 6. It's one of those catapult ones, and I think it's the one with the bunch of arms. Come on, open up. Here we are. There it is. And it is Venuvius. Vin Vin Venuvius! It's the spider-like one with multiple legs. And hopefully I got all the right parts, because I don't remember there being a fourth ball socket piece where it's got the two ball joints, so... I'm hoping it's there, but uh, let's go ahead and build it! Here is the Venuvius Breakout Beast out of the package, and I gotta say it looks pretty awesome with the red. I'm not sure how I feel about this kind of eggshell-ish color. I I'm not sure how I feel about it on the front there, because you can see it's patterned along here and on the arms and whatnot, but it just feels like, oh, a big chunk of it. Eh, that's that's kind of weird. Uh, by the way, one of these tail pieces does not have the printing that is the actual tail of the beast itself, and you've got a claw here. It's got the catapult thing, which I don't really care about, and uh, the face paint is pretty good. I do like the creation of this. I like how even when they take old parts, because this wave apparently has no new parts whatsoever, or at least I couldn't find any, uh, they could still manage to create something new, and so I like that. So with that out of the way, that is pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all this fun dudettes, and I will see you guys next time.